let's uh, start with where you're from. Calcutta. Which part? I'm adopted, I'm not really Indian. It would take a lifetime to search all the stations in India. So did you enjoy working on this film? Loved doing it. I was just so happy to be part of such a strong story and also Garth Davis is such a good director. And... Oh, it's just one of those stories when you read it, it's just so moving and incredible. I, I, I couldn't believe it was true, really. It's one of those things, like, you couldn't really make it up. If somebody just made it up and said, oh, you know, this is what's happening, you go, impossible. That would never actually occur. How long were you on the train? A couple of days. A couple of days. But there must be something else that you do remember. The platform I fell asleep on had this big rain tank. Oh, there are thousands of sessions with rain tanks. Did you enjoy working on this on this film? Oh man, it's been a complete dream. You know, it's one of the most nourishing experiences I've ever had of my career. You know, to be on the carpet with the real Briley's, it's like a real full circle moment. Extremely surreal, I think, collectively, if I don't mind saying, for everyone here. Jeff Patel, he's amazing, you know. He's, uh, he's a, such a lovely guy, off the stage as well. But he just embodies and exemplifies myself so well. And I don't mind saying that for everyone too, you know, from uh, Dave uh, Wenham to be my dad and Nicole Kidman for mum. Nicole is, yeah, yeah, first rate. She's in incredible. I've worked with her a couple of times, a few times actually. She's amazing. And Dev, one of the, one of the, uh, the businesses, most fantastic man. Talented and a, a very good man. And what was it like sort of working with Nicole as your mum? She's a complete movie icon and to have the opportunity to share the screen with someone like her, it's a real blessing. I knew him only as the character when we were filming and subsequently since we've been doing all the promotion I've gotten to really get to know him and he's just divine. Do you have any idea what it's like knowing my real brother and mother spend every day of their lives looking for me? You really nailed the Aussie accent. Oh, yeah. You did a great job. Was that a lot of hard work for you? It was eight months of utter repetition. I had beautiful, beautiful, amazing dialect coach, Jenny Ken, who went through the script with me day in, day out. And yeah, it took a lot of time. And what was it like working with our little Sonny, who, who came along and, as I understand it, didn't speak too much English? He spoke none. There's a little boy who plays Saru for the first half of the film. This little kid, I think he's eight and he carries the whole film. He is amazing. He's amazing. He's never been in front of a camera before, never flew on a plane, and to be holding this movie, he's just as astonishing. Oh, he's just lovely. And he's now, you know, he's got... I mean, we've been out and about in different parts of the States promoting the film, and he speaks English now.